Dear students, as you know, we are studying programming language and today we will further discuss the arithmetic operators that can be used in programming language such as C++. So these are the arithmetic operators available in C++. So one of the operator is addition minus multiplication. So for multiplication, you need to, need to write the static sign division and modulus operator so the first four are identical to what uh, what operators you have already used in mathematics however the last one is another operator which have been introduced by the programming language which is known as remainder operator and modulus operator sometimes we call it remainder operator or modulus operator or mod operator so how actually uh, all of the operators work so it is very simple for example if you write 5 plus 2 so it will give you 7 if you use the minus sign it is same as we use in the mathematics if we use static in between so it will give us the same thing as we have in mathematics however the operators division and remainder are little bit different in C++ so, for example, if you say 5 divided by 2 and 5 mod 2. So, what will happen? It will try to divide 5 by 2 and it will try to divide it on whole. So, for example, 2 2s are 4 and there will be a remainder of 1. So, when you use this remainder operator, this one will be achieved over here and this two can be achieved over here so this is the integer division and we are not at the moment talking about floating division at the moment because if both of the operands are float then it will give you the same answer as it was giving you in mathematics so 5.0 divided by 2.0 will give you 2.5 however we are talking at the moment about the integer division so we have the compiler over here int a is assigned 5 and let's say int b is assigned 2 so if you write C out A plus B. So what will you get? You will get of course 7. Yes, we have achieved 7 as an output. If you write minus, so let's see what is the output. So we have achieved 3, that is right, but whatever we were expecting. Then if you write the steric sign, which is called multiplication, so you will get 10. And now let's try the division operator. So it's an integer division as we have discussed and it will give you 2, not 2.5. So it will try to divide it at closest whole number and will give you the remainder and that remainder can be acquired using the remainder operator which we have applied right now so now can you guess if we change the values 10 and for example 2 so what would be the remainder so 2 uh, 10 can be fully divided on 2 by getting 5 as a quotient and 0 as a remainder so let's see whether we get 0 as a remainder or not. Yes, we achieved 0 as a remainder. And if you use the division operator over here, so you will get 5 because 5, 2s are 10. So this is very simple to implement these things in C++ language. So we have discussed and we have practiced all of these operators on this board and as well as on online compiler so if i summarize today's smart yule we have learned about arithmetic operators plus minus multiply divide and remainder operator and we have practiced them on 
online C++ compiler.